Hello guys. <coughs> and I'm now going to show you this video how how to get clean fish for TeamSpeak and maybe I'll show you how to do it for Skype. So let's get straight into it then. <coughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up the internet and copy the link that's in the description below. Or to type in clean fish for Skype. I mean for TeamSpeak. The comment says it'll be the very first page, you can go onto this one. What you do is just download the link right here. It's on Windows XP, Vista 7 and 8, so you're good there. Uh, it's really simple to use, so once you've downloaded that, it'll pop into the corner or whatever Windows you've got, depending where it goes. So you open this up, so let's close this down, and it will look like this. You'll pull it here onto your desktop, which will automatically there. And then open the TeamSpeak. <coughs> now, I've already got it used, like this is um, kind of fish for um, TeamSpeak at the moment. But what you need to do is you go set in the plugins and you need to allow the claim fish voice changer. But before you do that, what will happen is um it will come up with permissions and you basically just gotta allow it to work for TeamSpeak. If you don't allow it then it won't work. So basically when you've allowed it, you come on it. Then what you need to do is I think you need you need what well, I think. Uh you need to click plugins on settings, allow this, press reload all and then close. This should work. Unload TeamSpeak, load it back up. Press settings, plugins, see if it's selected. Go on plugins on like the actual taskbar, not settings, just plugins design as you claim for your voice changer. You got all of them here. You will be able you will be hearing your own voice. So just click here um um here hear voice on or off and just click off. Simple. You got loads of different things in it. It's quite good to be honest. You can trick your friends, you can control in but I just use it, and I use the deep manly voice, not sure like a full-on black dude. So yeah, <laughs> but that's pretty much how you do it for TeamSpeak. Um, Skype's different. Just all you need to do is type in um, simple clownfish for um, Skype. The link will be in the description below, as I said again, and just click download here. But anyway, you just download it off here again. Um, it will say Windows 10 because you might be watching the video when you got Windows 10. It's the exact same um, because Windows 10 is coming in and it is for free, by the way, guys. It is for free for anybody to download. So if I was you, go ahead and get that. <coughs> anyway, so you just download this, and once you've done that, it will come. Oh god, it will come down here. When you open this up, you double click it, and it'll open everything up, and it'll bring you down the little um your bar down here. What you do is right click on it, and then yeah, this this should come up, and then you're pretty much done for that. And then all you need to do is open up Skype, open up Skype, and then it will come up in a bar at the top here, and it will ask you to like um allow it. You've got to allow it on Skype, and then literally start Skype friends you call to change it. All you need to do is right click on there, click the voice changer. You got all these ones you can do. Go in voices and you got them here, or you got music, you know what music level and that, you got sound effects. You've got the VST effects, I don't know what it is, so anyway. So that's pretty much it. So you got all this in here, so hope you guys found this video quite helpful and the link will be in the description for both of these. Uh if you do not understand, um just give me a drop and I'll text you back and go for it slowly with you because I did do this video quite quick. So I hope you guys understood that, see you later.